Bible stories for children. Noah's Ark. A huge storm was coming and God wanted to protect Noah and the animals. So he told Noah to build a big boat. The animals climbed aboard two by two. It rained and rained till the entire world was flooded, but Noah and the animals were safe. After the storm, God made a rainbow and promised not to flood the world again. Baby Moses. The Hebrew people were slaves in Egypt, and Pharaoh, the king, was cruel to them. So one Hebrew mother hid her baby in a river to keep him safe. Pharaoh's daughter found the baby, looked after him, and named him Moses. He grew up to lead the Hebrew people, and God helped him guide them to a new land. Daniel and the Lions Daniel was the king's favorite servant. He loved to worship God, but one day a law was passed saying that people must worship only the king. Daniel kept worshiping God, which was against the new law. So the king had to throw him into the lion's den. But Daniel prayed to God for help, and God sent him an angel to save him. The Nativity Mary and Joseph traveled a long way to Bethlehem. There were so many visitors in town that they had to sleep in a stable, and that's where Mary gave birth to the baby Jesus. Out in the fields, an angel told the shepherds that Jesus was born. A bright star shone in the sky. Everyone celebrated because Jesus was the Son of God. The Storm Jesus and his disciples were on a boat when suddenly a mighty storm blew up. Jesus was sleeping, so the disciples woke him and cried out for help. Don't be frightened, said Jesus. Then he stood up and calmed the wind and waves. The disciples were amazed that the storm was over. They were safe. Jesus and the children. Whenever Jesus went, Crowds of people followed him. They listened to him talk and asked him for help and advice. Sometimes they brought their children along. The disciples tried to keep the children away from Jesus, but Jesus was good to everyone. He welcomed the children and treated them with love and kindness. Ten sick men. Ten men were very sick with painful sores on their bodies. No one in their village could heal them, so they called out to Jesus for help. When Jesus saw the ten sick men, he healed them. They all walked away. Well, again, but only one of the men came back to say thank you to Jesus. Jesus enters Jerusalem. Jesus was traveling to the city of Jerusalem. He asked his disciples to fetch him a young donkey that no one had ridden before. When Jesus rode the donkey into the city, crowds of excited people came to greet him. They praised him and scattered branches from palm trees in his path. The love of Jesus. All his life, Jesus taught about love, but some people were very jealous of him. One day his enemies nailed him to a cross to die. Jesus rose again and visited his disciples. He asked him to carry on teaching about love, kindness, and forgiveness. We can spread this message too because Jesus lives in all our hearts. The End